big spoiler alert. If you have not watched Is It Wrong to Pick Up Girls in a Dungeon Season 3 at all, or you're watching the anime right now and you're trying to get there, if you have not seen Episode 8 of Season 3, do not watch this if you don't want it ruined for you. Okay? So don't complain in the comments or anything below that I didn't tell you. This is Is It Wrong to Pick Up Girls in a Dungeon? Season 3, Episode 8. You've been warned giant spoilers other than that i hope you're right um as usual i'm gonna chop the video into like 25 30 second clips and then a little second or two break in between each clip that way i don't get copyright striked and my channel doesn't get taken down and i am uploading this episode because i mean there have been many times throughout anime uh that i've like been sad certain little moments and that i've cried over you know certain things and and sometimes it could be either good things or bad things that you know kick up some emotions in you while you're watching but uh what happens here in this episode specifically was to me like pretty fucking sad and hurtful and i was recording myself watching it and i didn't expect to cry <laughs> during the episode but i do end up crying at one point um and then i was like you know what fuck it I'm just going to upload it. Like, there's no reason for me to hide it and just keep the footage on my PC, right? So I'm not going to upload the entire episode, although I could upload the entire episode the way I do with Aho Girl if you guys want me to. But this is just my reaction to specifically the scene that got me and made me fucking cry. But anyways, I hope you enjoy the reaction and the little bit. And uh, any feedback that you guys have, please leave it in the comment section below. Maybe any other moments in anime you would like me to react to, just leave it down in the comment section below. I'll try and get around to it, and I will see you guys very soon. By the way, the next episode of the Owl Girl uh, reaction thing is coming between today and tomorrow. So, I hope you guys are uh, ready for that. See you soon. They might start saying Bell's a bad guy, bro. They're gonna lock him in with the fucking. Oh. Fuck. No. Is she disintegrating? Play with me, dog. <laughs> Motherfucker, bro. Wow. Don't get me wrong, like. That's gonna make impacts in her story in a good way, but fuck. I'm glad you guys are talking like you fuck. I feel like they're really drag like they're really making this overly sad. And it's working. I'm feeling it. I'm I'm feeling hurt, bruh. Is she even gonna return to normal? No, you're gonna pull an Avengers, bro. Fuck you. This is stupid. This is stupid. All that struggle, bro. Fucking white. Don't. 
てくれない怖い夢でもね今度は助けに来てくれた人がいたんだよ You're genuinely fucking hurting me right now, bro Don't do the flashback shit, dude. This sucks, bro. If this is the way this ends, bro, for her character at least, like, I'm gonna be pissed the fuck off the rest of the fucking season. Bell better turn into some kind of fucking demon or something. Like, after this. <clears throat> Are we bringing her back, you motherfuckers? Please. Please. And if you bring her back to life, fuck you still, because you played with my fucking feelings, you bitch. Come on. Do it. They have to do it, bro. They have to do it. Come on. It's gonna work, it's gonna work. There's no way they got this epic music and shit going on. It's not gonna fucking work. It's gonna work. Yes. Bring her the fuck back. That's what I'm talking about. Don't play with my fucking feelings. Yes. And I wanna know what fucking song this is. This shit is fire. Yes. Fuck yes. That's what I'm talking about. It wasn't for nothing, bro. God damn. <sighs> Motherfuckers had me hurt. Hurt. Yeah, I'm glad it was now. Bitch. Even though, of course, it would be now, right? For story purposes, but fuck. Can't be doing that shit.